check in with Paul Hagen right now. Paul, it seems like it's more uh, in the West Bay than in the East Bay. I'm outside. I don't see any smoke at all. So strange wind patterns do strange things, I guess. Yeah, you're a little north of us. We're in San Ramon, and we saw some of that kind of blowing overhead. It just looked like cirrus clouds overhead for a little while today. And the fire danger really not that high for this time of year. The atmosphere isn't overly dry. Relative humidity levels right now, the lowest that we can find, 34% in Concord. It's not uncommon this time of year for these numbers to be below 25%, even below 15 or 10%. So this is an okay amount of moisture in the atmosphere, and the winds aren't that strong by Bay Area standards either. It's an onshore breeze. That's why the fog is already making its return. So the fire danger, while it's certainly nowhere close to as high as it can be for this time of year, it's still enough. It's always enough as you hit the middle of July. Right now, temperatures have dropped back down to just above 60 degrees in San Francisco. 62 right now, 68 degrees Oakland, 60, I mean 81 degrees right now in Concord. It's a mixture of 60s, 70s, and 80s, just depending on your proximity to the water. Very similar temperatures to 24 hours ago. Really just not much change over the past 24 hours at all. As we head through this evening, let me get out of the way and show you this cute little face. It belongs to Oslo from Oakland. Thank you to Oslo's human Carly for sharing that picture with us. Temperatures on the east side of the bay dropping from the upper 60s down to around 60 degrees by 9 and 10 o'clock as that fog and low cloud cover is going to be crossing the bay and spreading inland as we head through the rest of tonight. Temperatures are going to start off tomorrow morning in the 50s, mostly in the mid to upper 50s. Some spots remaining right around 60 degrees, but this is a normal looking temperature map for the middle of July. And high temperatures again tomorrow, very close to where we're supposed to be for this time of year, within three degrees on either side of our mid-July averages. Let's zoom around and show you what we expect. Low to mid 60s along the coast. Optimistically hoping that that fog backs off the coast just a little bit during the afternoon. That'll help you warm up a degree or two from today. Mostly upper 70s and low 80s around the South Bay, a little farther into the 80s as you head into the Santa Clara Valley. These temperatures are pretty similar to what we had today, maybe a degree or two cooler for the Tri-Valley, mid 80s there, with mid to upper 80s as you head farther east in the Solano and Contra Costa counties. Temperatures in the mid to upper 60s and low 70s around the Bay, a mix of upper 70s and some low 80s for the North Bay before you start dropping back a little bit warmer for our neighbors to the north. Still low to mid 90s for Lake and Mendocino counties. Temperatures around the Bay Area warm up as we head into the weekend, but around 70 near the Bay, around 90 degrees farther inland. Not that hot for July. Coming up at 7 o'clock, we will take a look at tomorrow's fire danger hour by hour.